is back. The local barbershop gives more than just great haircuts and confidence to their customers. They're about to give back to the community in a very big way, and they're doing it this weekend. Joining us this more this morning, rather, with more on this fundraising event are let's get right to it. Master Barbers, Chris Ortiz, Michelle Alonzo, and Mark Garcia. I want to thank you guys for joining us once again. Thanks, Thanks for having us. us. So for our viewers that missed out on the first hour, let's talk about what Barber's Knock is all about. How long have you guys been in business? This Wednesday will actually be a year. That we've okay. Been yeah. Yeah. And, and we specialize in classic, contemporary, any kind of haircut. We really focus on straight razor. Now, um, what we were talking about earlier, though, that straight razor is like old school, right? Right. You right. typically don't see that. You too don't see much. it a lot anymore, and a lot of our customers say that that they don't see it anymore. Mm -hmm. So we try to really focus on that. So you guys really specialize in that. Yeah, absolutely. And did the customers really enjoy? Did they come back more just for that? A lot of people do. Yeah. yeah like I said, you don't see it. It's kind of a disappearing art, if you would. It is. So. I could definitely see that. I could definitely see that. So tell me, Michelle, um, you guys do more than just haircuts. We were talking about that earlier. Fundraising. How many fundraisers so far? This will be our fourth one. Okay. Yeah. So we really want to get involved in the community. We want to give back to the community that's given us so much so far this year. Yeah. And did you guys just think, you know, this is a great avenue for us to do that? Yeah. Um, it kind of worked out really well with doing one. We did uh, at the end of No Shave November, we mm -hmm. shaved off beards. To get to raise money for cancer, yeah, and, and it just kind of, just kind of spun off from there. So we got involved in like St. Baldrick's, and now we're doing the beard and mustache competition. And that's so the new one, that's right? That's the new one. The that's beard new one and mustache competition yes. this weekend. So, Mark, <laughs> tell me about that. Um, what do you think, and why did you guys start that? Competition? I think it's going to be a lot of fun. It was just a idea between us. We had gone to a couple beard and mustache competitions, and we thought we could really do our own and maybe bring it up a level and um, use it to as a platform to raise money and yeah. help other people. And where's the money going? The money is going to go to PB&J and we're also raising um, canned foods that's going to the storehouse. The storehouse. The storehouse. Yes. So it's pretty easy to enter, right? Correct. You just need a beard and mustache. Correct. There's a lot of people that have those. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> Hopefully you're not starting today and trying to get the competition this week. Sizes, whatever. <laughs> and it's, uh, we're asking for a $5 donation and five canned goods for registration. Okay, that's not bad at all. No. That's not bad at all. And I, I'm so excited to see all the great pictures that you guys are going to have There's for this competition. Awesome I thought ones. you said you were going to go. I'm going. Um, I'm going to enter. Just <laughs> kidding. <laughs> <laughs> you guys want me to be the, the judge? I don't know sure. anything about beards or mustaches. You don't want me to be doing that. <laughs> <laughs> so tell me, uh, if somebody wants to go uh, check out your location, where are you guys located at? We're on Montgomery and San Pedro. Okay. We face the Red Lobster, but we're right next door to the Little Caesars Pizza. Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, I want to thank you guys for joining us. There's information on your screen. We are going to toss it over to Kristen because she has a special guest for this event. Yes, I have with me Troy Rivas, and you can see he got a little head start on the mustache <laughs> competition. Troy, tell me a little bit about what are the judges looking for when it comes to facial hairstyles? Well, we have a few categories. We have two mustache categories, okay. uh, mustache styled and then a natural mustache. We have three beard categories. We have partial beard, short beard, and then we also have a full natural beard wow. and then a beard styled as well. Okay, so styled means you can kind of like you gel it, gel every, it anything. Anything you like, yes. <laughs> That's awesome. So basically, if you have hair on your face, you can kind exactly. of you can participate. Exactly. Now, just to recap there, what does it take to register? So uh, we, registration starts at 6 p.m. Okay. It's going to be located at Red Door Brewery Company, I-25 Candelaria. Okay. Uh, if you're entering the contest, we ask you to donate $5 to PB&J Family Services and five canned goods to Storehouse uh, Food Pantry. Awesome. Very great cause there, too. And I yes. just had to ask, how long does it take you to do that? Uh, this has been about a year and a half. I've trimmed it some, but I'm going to just let it go now and, uh, and let I it grow. Like but that. it's been about a year and a half So now. do you do that every day? Uh, I try to some mornings. I'm kind of lazy and just get up and go. So. <laughs> I love And are you going to do, are you going to be participating? I'm going to be one of the judges. No, I won't participate. Okay, so. but one of the judges. Yes. Sounds good. So anyone and everyone is welcome. That's this weekend, correct? This weekend. Yeah, this Saturday. Yes, ma'am. Sounds good. For more information, you can visit our website, krqe.com. Thanks so much for joining us Thank this you. morning, Troy. We'll be right back.